all right guys welcome back to the channel it's your boy king so we're definitely about to go talk to lucian or lucan about the secret uh battle club so let's go do that <clears throat> Man, I have to say it again. This this game, wow. And I didn't actually think that this would be like my favorite game that I've played. Like God of War was there, and then I just finished up uh, For Spoken. That was pretty good, but For Spoken does not even. I've only played this game for uh, I probably say what two days now. And already, I'm still at the beginning of the game. Already, I would just, I would give up. For, I would give up for, for spoken if it meant that they were creating another game of this. Like that's just how good this game is. And I feel like it's just only gonna get even better. Right now, we're still experiencing Hogwarts itself, man. I can't wait to get out to the real world. Okay, so every time, oh, okay, I see. Just over there. Okay. When I'm not recording, I should probably just go around the castle, unlocking all the travel points. Revelio. Let me see. Ah, oh, there we go. I just did that. I didn't even know I could actually do it. That's why you gotta explore. That's why you gotta test things out, man. Revelio. These blues indicate that we can't get in there yet. All right, this is the guy. Can I help you? Oh, he's a youngin. All right. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinated duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does Cross Wands work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. Or is this like a so PvP? We're determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Yes. Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in crossed ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Get me in the Let's ring. Go. Let's go. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! Get thrown into the deep end as soon as we can. We'll make you regret signing up. Oh, I didn't know they were all gonna be assholes. Alright, break through your shoes. Alright, so yellow shoes can be break through with levitation spells like Yoso, Target, Trackings, okay. Oh, I forgot. All right, I gotta pay attention to my surrounding. Is he down? Oh, that was fun. Some big hits that round. That was pretty fun, huh? Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up, and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. 
I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Hope to see you back here again. All right, cool. All right, let's get in, let's get back to our main mission. I think we have to go talk to Professor Weasley. Okay. Let's see something. Hold on. Click on it. Okay, I haven't found it. Okay, I see. Let me see. Can I go here? Yeah, this will get me closer. Here we go. Travel. Hmm. Load time is a. That's not bad, I guess. Revelio. Oh, my bad. Wait. Ah, I'm gonna get distracted. I wonder if that's enchanted music or is somebody actually playing the violin somewhere. Hold on, let me see this picture. But what survives the reign of this headmaster? I think we should have a moon calf in charge. Hmm, what is that, I wonder? Oh, here we Rebellion. go. Rebellion. See, that's why you have to explore, man. It was the blue orb that drew me over there. And there was a page hiding there. That's pretty cool, man. Okay, am I going the right way? Yes, I do like cats. I love dogs, but I like cats. Adventure, are we? Okay. What about the room, Professor? Is that I was grandfather? thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Oh, ah, that's so cool. There you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Can you tell me more about the potions shop, Professor? J. Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Professor Sharp asks that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. 
Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of ah, I should have picked Sebastian. Harlow, if you can. <laughs> Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Revelio. Revelio. Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Rapero in no time. Why must I first complete tasks to learn Rapero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience, and these tasks should provide you with just that. Such experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Rebellion. This is the right area. Got it. Flying page must be around here somewhere. Accio! Brilliant. I trust the preliminary tasks weren't too. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic.
That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Repair. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> Revelio. Revelio. Bro, that's so cool, man. There's something in there. I just know it. Hello. I, I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Are there any other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves the mystery. Lumos. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. There's something here. This looks like the location from the painting. What could oh. be so special about it? Okay, that didn't work. Lumos. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Oh, okay. How do I do it? Just... Ha! I knew there was a connection. I should tell the Nora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. All right, cool. Is she up there? All right, let's go up there and tell her real quick. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Meat, although he does tend to over-explain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth! I should have seen them. Honestly, my best friend, Clive. 
I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Is that the Baron? I think he's a ghost of Slytherin. He also killed the daughter of Rowena, I believe. Or did he kill oh did he kill Rowena? Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. Rebellion. I'm glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Really? Yes. I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a better be in the village. I need to stop by the, <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. <sighs> I cannot tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. Grave mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. I believe you. Though I suppose you would not really call it elective when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas. Yeah, I would like to see it in Christmas. Of year, I would rather be indoors. <laughs> not much for the cold, are you? Oh, I do not mind the cold so much, but it has taken some getting used to. I love cold I weather. I did not grow up around snow. I believe it's because I was born in December, but oh, it probably wait, has nothing to here. do with it. <laughs> I often spot lace wing flies in this area. Oh? What's lace. so special about them? They are interesting to look at, but if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Hmm. If we stew them, we can use them in potion making. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I wonder if this is just an enchantment type of flower. Or, because... You would think other humans would see flowers like this in the outside world. Wow, look at that. That is amazing. I, I can't wait to be able to use our broom. What look, is that? From the Forbidden Forest. Hippogriffs. Hippogriffs. I wonder if something startled them. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. That's pretty cool. I heard that, um, you know, although the hippogriffs are pretty cool, they're not very fast when you're flying them. Absolutely. And that the broom is is your fastest means of transportation, other than That's fast traveling. That's the forbidden forest on the left. It's off limits to students, as the name implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Ah, there's Hogsmeade over the crest. What's I wonder if I had gone with Sebastian, would he have taken me into the forbidden forest? Let's see if I can actually go. Nope. Ah. That's a pretty cool coat. I think that's a Quidditch coat for Gryffindor. Wow, look at that. Do we got photo mode in this game? No, nah, we don't. Okay. Well, that sucks. Maybe they'll add it into the game later. I would spend all of my time exploring if I could. I thought you could I only see these things if you've seen death. You mentioned that you knew the area since you're relatively new here. Maybe she I have. She said that. Mm. 
She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal in class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. I agree. Another thing is, um, I think we did. We saw though, when we were in the carriage, we saw a boy get killed by the dragon. But I think we saw those little horse things. I forgot what you call them before a boy got killed. Wait, no, we didn't. No, we didn't. We saw them after. Revelio. Revelio. How are you settling in? I remember the weeks that followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. I'm getting used to things. What about you? Do you finally feel settled? I still miss my homeland, but it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully it will for you too. Repairer! Lumos. Never hurts to see what these things are. Okay, there we go. I don't know. Mr. Man. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Who would have guessed the Hogsmeade was this far away? away? Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss On I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Moon? Jemmy, guys, Dudley and Arian. Mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Poor Mr. Moon. A Demi, guys. Revelio. I think we had too much fun in the village. I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. Accio. Nearly there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just Hogsmeade. I am happy to explore whenever you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I'll keep that in mind, Natty. Thank you. And here we are. It is hard to know where to start. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter beer. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spellcraft, some seeds, and... A new wand. Of course. You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Enjoy yourself. I will see you soon. <laughs> 